Welcome back to Black Star Dove. Welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm gonna need that HBO special, which means help a brother out. I'm trying to get the 1,000 subscribers. I just need you to hit that subscribe button and go ahead and like the video. It does help. Anything that you can do to help, I most definitely appreciate. And then don't forget to share the video as well. Um, since this is the last video of the year, I have a different video in the background. You know, I usually have some type of picture or something like that. I went back just for this video to show my old, well, a uh, YouTuber I follow a lot, but this is an old video of his. It's called Flossy Carter. Uh, everyone knows, who knows me knows, I'm an extreme Flossy Carter supporter. Um, he has over a million subscribers now. I've been following him for like 10 years. Like, I, I think I was like, I started following him when he had less than 100K. So, big ups to him. Um, this is just like a little bit of a year-end review video of some of the things I've noticed while doing this channel. So, let's, let's look at the few notes I have. Alright, as of right now, I have 791 scrubs. Says scrubs. <laughs> I have 791 subs. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, I have over 100 videos. And like I said before, when I first started doing this channel, I was doing three videos a week. And then I think like after two or three months, I just I started doing just two videos a week. Um, so that's how I was able to get that many videos. Now, let's see here. I have over 2,400 watch hours. And I have over 24,000 views. Um, most of my views come from the U.S. and the U.K., and 65%, 65% of the people that watch my videos are not subbed. That is crazy. 65%. I just need you to go ahead, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. I have over 100 videos. I'll admit some of the videos in the beginning are not that clear because I go from using like the um, the microphone that came with the with the iPhone to get an exterior mic to have it now this mic so the, the quality does improve but I do have over a hundred videos go ahead check them out um, let's see here what else is there something I noticed is something that someone told me um, but I really didn't believe it until like I started having my own channel really only 5% of the people that watch you actually comment like you'll get way more views than you will ever get comments and I never noticed that until I started having my own channel. So now while I'm going on other people's uh, pages and channels, even the popular ones, I'm looking at the views versus the comments. Like, i seen a video with 100,000 views, but it literally had like 500 comments. And I was like, that shit crazy. Because you never really pay attention to it until you start doing your own thing. Because you're like, well, I got people watching it, but no one's really commenting. But they was like, yeah, only like 5 to 10% of people will actually will comment. And I was like, so that made me start thinking about me, what type of YouTube videos I watch. And do I comment on all my videos? And I'm like, man, if I, if I watch 20 videos in a day, I literally might comment on two or three of them. So I was like, it's that 10% range. Like, oh, man, like, this is something that I'm doing myself. Like, I'm not even commenting on every video that I'm seeing. So... Yeah, it's just, it's just strange. Like, well, well I see it's strange because I'm a content creator. But from the grand scheme of things, if you think about it even yourself, that what you're, you're watching this video, how many videos do you usually comment on? How many videos are you watching? You know? And if you feel like it's in that 5 to 10% range, I'm like, man, just like, it just, it, it just wakes up your mind. Um, stuff that I know that, um, a lot of my videos, especially like the ones that are like about the popular topics, of course, those are the most popular. I have a lot of also have a lot of videos that's like giving really good knowledge, especially when it comes to like black being being like a better black man. Uh, stuff like what's all needed besides cr good credit to get credit cards and stuff like that. I think I'm gonna redo that video because now I have a better mic. Um, just like you no, know, a whole lot of videos I have that's actually like giving actual game i'm gonna try to re-record those because i have a better microphone and see now that i have a bigger audience can those reach more people 
Um, but it's just so much I learned. I'm gonna start doing some collaborations and stuff soon. I got something lined up, but just just doing this. I never thought that I would have this channel and have over a hundred videos. I thought honestly thought I would have quit long long time ago. Um, but I actually like doing this. Like I see myself, like I'm seeing myself in the camera. Uh, I'm investing in my business. Um, like I said, th this mic right here, even though this mic was only a hundred dollars, this is still a really good investment. Um, I need to get one of those boom things right here, but other than that, I'm gonna take care of that. Like I said, I'm gonna get a new camera, probably Sony or Canon, um, whichever one, probably Sony. So I got that coming. But yeah, this, this is a small year end recap. Um, I hope you hope this year was able and better than last year. So I hope this 2021 was better than 2022. Um, it was for me. You know, I was able to excel in my career. Um, love life was okay. <laughs> um, kind of crashed and burned, but that's okay. Um, but I'm, I'm going to keep fighting and keep you know, going forward and hopefully have a, a better 2022. Uh, I grew a lot as a man. I grew a lot as a content creator, uh, especially during that time where my son was away and living in Ohio. But now he's back. So I'm most definitely trying to make the most of it. Uh, I hope you make the most of your 2022. And I hope, really hope that if you look back at your 2021, there's a whole lot more positives than there was negatives. Because we, we could all use it. And, you know, I really wish you the best going forward. I have nothing against you. Like, I have no dog in your race. So I have no reason for you not to not to want to see you succeed. Because there's enough out here for everyone. And I promise you'll get your slice too. Take care. I love you. Peace.